All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Jujutsu Kaisen season two, episode nine. In the last episode, we had well, the title of the episode was the Shibuya instance. However, nothing's really happened yet. Well, I mean, obviously the 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 cloaks or the the veil is down. Everybody's kind of starting to fight. Uh, they tried to gang up on Gojo. It kind of worked because they kind of figured out by implementing their domain into their attacks. It was able to kind of break through infinity. The episode kind of ended, uh, kind of ended off with uh, Gojo taking down the the, the the blindfold, the bandana, whatever. Um, and you know shit's about to get serious when the eyes come out. So let's see how that's going to go. Um, Yuji was there as well. The, the pacing was a little bit off, I got to admit. Um, the fight was cool. And honestly, I do appreciate when Yuji gets time to shine and gets time to fight. Um, there was a, a lot of, there was a bit, a few issues like I saw um, on Twitter, like one of the animation like tests or whatever it's called beforehand or the storyboarding of what that scene looked like. And then the, what the scene actually looked like, there was a lot of motion and a lot of um, ghosting, I think it's called in the scene. So I don't know, that was, that was kind of a choice from Mapper, but hopefully Yuji gets to shine properly in this, um, in this arc. Very excited for it, so let's gonna get straight into this episode today. As always, guys, if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well. And let's go into this episode right now. What do you think of Satoru Goju? My benefactor. He's an idiot. Yep, I can say say that for certain too. He's the strongest. Damn right. He protects you. Who's this? Is it Gojo? What's happening? Is this now or back in the day? Bro looks like he's struggling. Shiba, Shiba instant gate open. Okay. Weed. <laughs> oh, is he talking to the, the flower? Flower curse. You're going to catch this hollow purple this time. Oh, I already feel like they're snapping on this episode with the animation. He, he just touched him. He said, like, right, you're going to catch these hands this time. No infinity. Bro, he's literally just putting hands on them. He's fucking strong as hell. Bro, why are all these people standing still? What is happening? That's fucking cool. Like, rooting themselves into the wall. Bro, look at this angle. That's fucking crazy. This this episode's gonna be part of, gonna be crazy by the animation already. I forgot actually most people here can't see these curses. Oh my god, he looks fucking insane. Oh nah! You're gonna rip the head off? Jesus Christ! Oh, you can actually see their eyes! Oh! He doesn't give a fuck about the humans. Damn. And they, I mean, this is how it should be. I forgot he was here! Oh, he's a person? Why'd the electricity go off? What happened? This asparagus? Damn! Look at him, bro. He just has to walk at you. It's insane that you'd want to possibly even try fight this man. He doesn't care. Fuck. You were saying? Gone. Non-existent. Deceased. So is this a mix of like, he is, he obviously, but way back when he reached the point of just being basically a god and he sees the people, these people, it's just nothing really. He doesn't really care about them. Or is it just a point of like, you know, some people are going to die, but it's all for the greater good kind of thing. Maybe it's a mix of both. So they've got to keep him within a four meter space for one minute. 
Good luck. I wouldn't mind specials of just seeing these guys doing normal shit like this and not being fucking villains. <laughs> Impossible task. <laughs> that thing. Oh, my guy is psychotic. He's a fucking demon. What the hell? They're just bouncing off him. That's crazy. The music. Oh, my God. This is creepy. Proper eerie. Oh, damn. He's just pissed off. This is like a minor inconvenience. What's he gonna do? Oh shit. What's coming? Oh, Ghetto's down here. How are you gonna get him on edge? Oh wait, are they in the same place as Kojo? Wait, what? Oh, okay, this is a different place. They're finding Mahito. Oh god, they're going to Gojo. Aren't there people on the tracks? I wouldn't get on this train. Oh god. Y'all can't see through the windows? What anime, anime light bullshit is this? Yep. Y'all don't want in there. Nope. Run away. Run away. You're dead. Oh, he took a chunk of his brain. This bitch! I hate him. Yeah? This freak. <laughs> Maji. <laughs> Gojo, if there was ever a time to just let loose, it would be now. Just go ham. Fuck everybody else here. Oh, I wish he connected with that. He deserves to be knocked the fuck out. He deserves so much more than that. Where's Yuji? I need him to give him the left and right. Bro. Oh, God. I like how not once... I, I don't know if I like it or not, but I kind of like that not once does Gojo try to save any of these people. Honestly, it's a better dynamic than, like, the main character getting distracted by saving people and then the villains winning. Yeah, Yuji would try to save all these people, probably. Yeah. He's being realistic about the situation. I still don't think he'll care, no matter how many of these people die. I think it's if, like, Yuji or someone came through and something happened to them, that's when his, like, sw his switch would be flipped. What? What? Oh, my God. Oh, he's doing it. Oh, no. Oh, look, Joker. <laughs> what the fuck? What's happening? Oh my god, this boy's quick! Two tenths of a second? He's a fucking animal! And this was a gamble he didn't know for sure? This is fucking nuts. Oh my god, he's so quick. I suppose he's technically within his domain right now, isn't he? This is all within two tenths of a second? Oh my Christ, dude. Two months later? 
Oh, so what? They were in like a vegetative state. Is that what he like? That is that what they're saying? This is fucking naughty. That must have used a lot of energy. Oh, so this is where we're up to now. 299 seconds. Okay, so that wasn't in two tenths of a second. But to everybody else, I, I guess it was. I don't know, it's a bit hard to understand. And they're all in like a... Vegetative state, is what it's saying, I think. So what happened? What about Mahito and Go Joga and why not? Oh, Jogo. Uh-oh. Oh god, is it Ghetto? What is that? It's like a curse object? Cube? Oh shit. Have they done it? What the fuck? Oh, this thing's ugly. Oh shit. Bro. A fake? Huh? What? Yeah, it's him. What do you mean? Bro. Their life. Oh no, they've got him! So that distraction, him seeing Ghetto was the one minute distraction. No way Gojo loses. Right. Is it not Ghetto? What the fuck? Who the fuck is that? What is that? What the hell? So this isn't Ghetto? What? All this time? Ooh, Yuta. We, we need him right now. Oh my god, yeah. JJK Zero, those are fucking awesome, man. I mean, Gojo is the strongest. Is this about to end on a cliffhanger? Bro. Yuji! He's not here yet. Oh my god, he's not here yet! <laughs> Little walkie talkie. Wait, Mega Mario's still alive? Wait, what? What? Bro! Right, so that was JJK Season 2, Episode 9. I have no idea what the hell just happened. Gojo popped off. Honestly, a lot of the abilities and kind of like stuff that happens, especially around Gojo and his abilities in this show are quite confusing. Um, he used his domain for two tenths of a second, but in reality it was 299 seconds in real time and he was moving quick as hell for them. But he wasn't? I don't know. Crazy episode, Ghetto, not actually him being Ghetto is a shock. It's some kind of curse that's taken over his body. So Ghetto really did die then, I guess, at the end of... Would have been at the end of JJK Zero, because Gojo apparently killed him then. Bro, I have no idea. What the hell is going on? I mean, now Gojo's sealed, whatever that means. Like, Yuji's on the way, which, yeah, he's probably going to be able to save him, which is cut fine, but what the hell does Sealed mean in this instance? He's in, like, some sort of prison realm? I don't know, man. I'm fucking confused. Overall, though, very good episode. The animation was fucking stellar. Um, who was it? Hanami? Hanami's dead now, so one of these big, big bad curses has gone down. Um, I wish it was Mahito, for real. Um, Jogo, jo Gojo's, Jogo's fine. He's pretty funny. I like that he's Buggy's voice actor. I think his voice is funny. Um... 
But yeah, uh, very excited for the next episode. So anyway, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching my reaction. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out.